टुडे आई वॉन्ट टू टेल यू ए वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग मोटिवेशनल एंड इंस्पर इंस्परेशनल स्टोरी ऑफ एन ईगल हाउ इट इज इंफ्लुएंसिंग पीपल टू मेक टफ डिसीजन इन देर लाइफ द ईगल्स लाइफ स्पैन इज ऑफ सेवेंटी इयर्स एंड इट इज डिवाइडेड इंटू टू पार्ट्स द फर्स्ट फोर्टी इयर्स एंड द नेक्स्ट थर्टी इयर्स वेन द ईगल रीचेस अट अराउंड द एज ऑफ फोर्टी द क्लास और द टैलेंट्स द बीक एंड द फेदर्स they all become incompetent the sharp beaks become weak and bent the talons become rigid and inflexible and also the feathers become heavy due to which it can't fly like how it used to do before and feels difficult to carry its own weight these three are very important for it to catch and grab the prey so now it has to decide whether to die or to survive it always chooses to survive by going and sitting on a top of mountain and starts knocking its beak to a hard rock or wood until it completely falls off it is a painful process but it will bear the massive pain as it has to go through this transformation now it will wo- wait for it to go back and once it grows it will start using its new beak to remove the talons and start plucking its own feathers this whole process takes around 150 days to complete and till that time it will wait patiently as it knows there is going to be a regrowth and rebirth once all these three things are in place it finally starts to fly and catch its own prey this is something which is a good life lesson which we need to learn similar situation happens to most of the human beings where we have to make tough decisions whether we are going to embrace the change or just going to sit for 150 days doing nothing as the time and years passes by the competition becomes tougher and tougher and opportunities becomes lesser and if you don't utilize whatever is already available around you you will be losing on plenty of opportunities i just wanted to reiterate what i said when someone is offering you training courses and programs and opening doors for career opportunities make the best use of it and learn as much as possible the moral of the story is eagle you you are all wondering why i chose this eagle story because eagle is a bird which represents ambition duty fortitude and a strong will power to overcome many obstacles and strive to achieve great heights look around you stop complaining about failures and start taking actions in order to survive we have to start a change process take advantage of the present get rid of our fixed mindset the problem is common to all but the attitude to solve it makes the entire difference don't be afraid of changes accept it gracefully and my question to you is do you want to fly with the eagles or scratch with the turkeys the question is for you to answer if you are a highly ambitious person and want good career then struggle and learning is inevitable if the price is the main concern then let's talk about the price you can also email us asking for discount and i have given a lot of discounts for people who are especially to you know having 2 to 3 years of experience they told us that they are not able to afford the training program they would like to attend all the training programs but because of their salary they are not able to afford and many have lost jobs because of pandemic many are having personal issues many have also had a long employment gap the main intention to help is to help people gain confidence levels and also help them in any way possible many express that they are only stuck with uh, certain activities like a cs icsr or Uh, only literature activities or they are only doing some kind of triaging um, opportunities are 
they also told me that they are many companies are asking for experience and they are not getting any interview calls and they say that the companies are not giving them opportunities so let me tell you out of my experience the opportunities are not given the opportunities are created so improve your skill set improve your knowledge approach the right person and tell them hey i can help you with these 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 activities or i can help you with the growth of organization and this is what i can contribute this is the way they notice people and this is the main difference between a doer and an achiever a doer is a person who keeps on waiting for the things to happen and an achiever is a person who will take actions and make it happen so i hope that this video has motivated you and influenced you at least a little bit and please share this video with your friends and colleagues who are you know making just waiting to make decisions and also i would like to see you all in the training session thank you very much for watching this video